Hi, hey, hello, my name is Jerry Carrillo, and today I'm telling a story about how to become the best fighter in the world. <sighs> okay, so the other day, like a few days ago, I was talking to my friend Aaron, and he, he, this kid, he's been fighting since he was five. He has a good 12 years of experience under his belt. Um, five years competitive, 12 years training. Uh, this kid knows what, what's up. And one of my friends asked him, hey, like, how, how do you know how to fight? How can I become the best fighter? And Aaron told him this. He said, look, the only way I know to become the best fighter in the world, you get into a fight where you give it your all, your absolute everything. You go in till every ounce of your soul knows that you gave it your best and you still lose. That's how you become the best fighter in the world. And I was like, dude, like, what's up, man? Like, that's it's a little intense. He's like, dude, guess what? The world is intense. Something you need to know, Jerry, is it'll hurt. You'll be destroyed, but you get back up. And after that happens a few times, then you might become an okay fighter. Um, he said, but Oscar, check this out. That happens to every fighter. Because guess what? There will always be fighters who are faster, better, stronger, more skilled, have more experience than you, and that's okay. The only important part is that you keep getting up and you keep on trying. He's like, but I'm, I'm, but I'm gonna break it to you. He said, the first time it happened to me, he's like, I cried. Uh, I went to the bathroom, uh, both, I cried both because of the pain and just the emotional hurt, um, but it humbled me. It let me know that there's still room to grow, and it's a nice thing to know. All right, hope you have a great rest of the day, guys. Um, good luck. God bless. I, I hope to be doing these one, one every day for the next 30 days. Have a great day, guys. Bye.